Good morning, everybody. Good morning. It's about 7.30. On New Year's Eve. On New Year's Eve, and it's beautiful out here. Yeah, we are here in Mahan Beach, California. And mm -hmm. in case you're wondering where it is, it's about 10 minutes south of Los Angeles mm -hmm. Airport, LAX. Yeah. It, it, we're right next to the beach, actually, so you'll see mm -hmm. it a little yeah. later. It's pretty we, cool. Yeah, we, are, we have a, a hot tip here from a book that we received for Christmas from our niece, mm -hmm. Road Food. It, it has, a, what, highlights... Uh, all the different and eaters guys local hot spots and hidden gems yeah so right behind us is called uncle bill's pancake house yeah, it's in this book we've been here before though yeah a long time so, ago yeah but it's in this book and we're gonna go try it out yes uh famous for their pancakes yeah. it's, it's called baby. pancake house mm -hmm. right okay here we go Corned beef hash with some eggs over easy. Look at these hash browns. They look pretty amazing. And you can get your muffin, your toast, or your pancakes. And we got the pancakes. Buttermilk pancakes. What I got was a chili cheese omelet with fresh avocados, also hash browns in it. This is what they're known for. Nice, fluffy buttermilk pancakes. Butter, syrup, very simple. Very good. The edges are a little bit crispy. The pancakes. You can tell they have a little bit of flavor in them. Great flavoring in the pancakes. Look at how nice and fluffy that is. And this minute, this meal came out like five minutes maybe, because yeah, it's not really busy right now, so it's really fast. It's all good. Chili cheese omelet. I'm a sucker for chili cheese omelets, so a lot of places I go, I like to try it out. Here we go. Great chili flavor. Not spicy. It's a good chili flavor to it. And the hash browns, you could tell that they're freshly grated. Nothing out of the bag here. A little bit crispy on the outside. You can tell. Great. Especially with the avocado. Bye. That's going to be a good one. Mm -hmm. Nice and crispy. You can tell. Look at how they're grating. It's kind of cool. Fine. Lightly seasoned. Perfect hash browns. Look at that corned beef hash, those mm -hmm. big patties. Corned beef hash. Nice and meaty in there. Good corned beef hash. It's kind of fancy though. I like the cheap one, but it's good. And they also gave some uh, salsa. Mm -hmm. My turn, get in on some of this pancake action here. There you go, a little bit of butter. Very good pancakes, fluffy. I like the little crispy edges along the outside. It's perfect. I know the regular stack has like three of them, but there's two plus the omelet. Perfect combo. That's a wrap from Uncle Bill's Pancake House. So good. The food uh, is full. so good here. We're really full. Uh, get here early. Yeah. Uh, you can see all the seats behind us. Yeah, check it out. All these That's, seats are for people waiting in queue. Yeah, but later. it's no reservations. It's first come, first serve. Yeah, on the weekends, it could get real crowded mm -hmm. here. I get, again, get here early. I think it opens at 7. 
uh, six. It opens at six. Six oh, a.m. Wow. They have a street parking around here, but it is metered, and parking is free before eight o'clock. So right. if you're an early riser, come here before what seven. It takes them maybe about thirty minutes to an hour to eat. You have free parking. Right. As you see, we're only like one block from the beach, yeah. so we'll take a quick walk down there and check things mm -hmm. out. Other than that, we'll see what else we do tonight yeah. or later on today. Yeah. So stick around and see what we do. Okay, we're here in the afternoon for New mm -hmm. Year's Eve, and uh, we're doing really nothing special. Nah, nothing. We're, in, we're in Gardena now. We're at Tokyo Central. This is a kind of a cool store because this one is like half Hawaiian, half Japanese, uh, maybe food-wise. Mm -hmm. So it, if you haven't been to one, you should tour into one. It's pretty cool. It is. They have a lot of cool stuff, yeah. a lot of good eats and snacks, yeah. and they have some eating places inside they here. They do. So we're going to go check it out. We had to do a little bit of shopping. So this is where we, really we shop. Yep. These are one of our favorite frozen, it's called gyoza, which are just pot stickers. They come frozen and they come in different uh, flavors, different meats, proteins. And it's only four dollars and forty-eight cents. It's like two meals for us at home. Got a whole bag, like a couple pounds. Good deal. Out of all the Portuguese sausages that are here, we recommend the purity one. This is a really good one. Yep, I remember that one. Right and this there. is the only place as well that you can get the zippies. Expensive though, but the zippies chili. Those packets over there. Or, uh, for iced coffee, this is one of my favorite ones from UCC, the Kona one. They have this kind too, but this is a little bit sweeter. This is less sweet and it has that nice little Kona coffee taste to it. I like this one. That finishes our shopping here mm -hmm. at uh, Tokyo Central. Mm -hmm. We got a lot of good stuff. We did. Now, uh, what to do for dinner tonight? I am in the mood for sushi. See, I see one sushi. I want some, uh, I don't know, chicken cutlet or something. We'll see. Yep. We finally made it to our dinner destination. Mm -hmm. It is like at 5, 30, 6 o'clock. Yes, we had a little trouble finding what to eat. Uh, the place chicken cutlet, it was, the place was closed. Mm -hmm. Sushi, uh, not really finding a place. So we did settle on a Korean uh, tofu house. It's mm -hmm. called BCD Tofu House. This is a pretty cool place. The meals are really inexpensive and they're good and it's very filling. Now this so. is a chain um, is restaurant and they have <coughs> sorry <coughs> locations in Seoul, yeah, Korea. Yeah, Seoul. They have it in LA. I know there's some in Koreatown. Maybe New here. York. Yeah. There's one in New York. Yes. They're all over the place. Right. So this they're really good. Chances are you're probably close to a yeah. BCD tofu yeah. house. Ready to go inside? Let's go inside, babe. Let's eat. So this is what they're really famous for, the sun tofu plate right here. I think we're gonna go for the C1, the Kalbi combo. They have other ones too here. What we have is a yellow poker here. Everybody gets all of this stuff. And we have our banchan. So it's our kimchi, bean sprouts. These are really good. Potatoes. That looks like some sort of maybe eggplant or some sort or something. And this is garlic with squid. This is all really good banchans. These are all, except for the Kroger, all of the banchans are refillable as you eat. Sometimes they're 
on, on the warm side and sometimes they're hot, but usually they're on the warm side. Mm. It is really good. It's kind of fishy though, so you have to be used to it. They house make their kimchi. Mm -hmm. Not good. Not too spicy today. It looks really hot. But it's not. So far, at least the best I had wasn't too spicy. Stop. Can I come in? Yes, please. Thank you. 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 Stirring that egg in there. Makes yeah. it nice and creamy. Now, this is. Yeah, you don't have to have it in there. We right. always like it in there. Yeah, in. This, is, so this is still mine. is isn't bubbling anymore, but Bill's is still bubbling. Barely, but yeah. We both got it medium with pork. With pork. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And this is the tofu. Tofu is really soft in here. And this is so. Ouch! The rice is hot. It's so good. Let's see. Make sure I don't burn myself. It's a little hot. Very. Very good. Thank very soft tofu. Really good. They of course picks up the flavor of whatever you eat. This is definitely worth it. This whole meal. This is like fills yeah. you up and it's hearty. Look at this. Giant spread here. I'm going to go for the Cal B, which is a beef short rib. This is the kind that we had in Hawaii from Ted's Bakery. It's got the short rib bone in it. It's really hot. Very tender. It's got that charcoal the barbecue taste to it. A little bit sweet, marinade. I think it's a typical Korean type of uh, short rib marinade that they use. It comes right off the bone. Very good. Nice and hot. I'm going to try out this uh, tofu soup. You can see the pork inside of it. Yeah, the tofu here is silky smooth, very soft, and even though we got it mild, I don't say it's, it's like a mild plus, it's got a little bit of heat to it, I like it though. One of our favorite sides over here. It's the potato. Yeah. yeah. They're super soft. But enough to still hold the potato okay? The taste is a little bit on the sweet side and it's soy saucy. Because it's perfect with this meal. I like the also the green bean scrubs. They're cold and they're crunchy. Mm. Sesame taste to it. Bean sprouts with sesame taste. So good. Look at this piece. This is the piece. So, take out. I always like my meat near the bone. That's where all that fatty is. Mm. Clean bone. Very good taste. Type of bone? Korean type barbecue taste. A little bit of sweetness. That fat on that bone, it's yum. This is why you get this. So good. It came at a perfect time because it is busy and the crowd waiting. I'll try this one out. 
you know what it is, it's a burdock root. It's marinated in some type of a light sesame oil. It's cold. And it's refreshing. This one here is what garlic? Can I get some? Oh, that's a good one right there. That's garlicky. Very garlicky. And it's hot. It has the same type of hotness as the kimchi does. I think I need some uh, sweet beef with that. Wow. Look what we found. There's onions on the bottom. Grilled onions. They grilled them, them in this they grilled them in this sauce so they're not they're soft they're not crunched at all let's put a few pieces on top of my shirt right here there you go mm. right there perfect life a little bit of rice that wraps up our full day new year's eve uh thanks for coming along with us from yeah. breakfast to shopping at yeah. our japanese supermarket and having some korean dinner yeah it was really good i'm so full i'm ready yeah, to go home it was a great deal yeah. of course we'll put the total right here again mm -hmm. um wow I'm fresh full. food for full um when you eat tofu you feel so healthy even with the side stuff that it's maybe not so healthy but you feel healthy so it's so good yeah this is actually the first time we got the cow beef the, yeah. uh, the beef yeah, short ribs and it's excellent yeah okay. in fact we're gonna get that next time I yeah think. probably yeah so wow uh, i hope everyone had a great and fun new year yes hope everybody stayed safe yes uh we have a lot of stuff planned for 2020 uh-huh it's gonna uh, be a lot of fun yeah we're gonna even start Bright and early tomorrow morning for our first 2020 vlog. We are. You ready? Ready, baby. Okay. Well, thanks for following us the entire year. I know we yes. mentioned it last week. We want to thank uh, thank everyone for supporting our channel. Mm -hmm. It's been lots of fun. Yes. Lots of travel. It's a lot of fun. Thank you so much for saying hi to us when you see us just roaming around. So yeah. it's, it's so much fun. We know we'll go back to Vegas this coming year. We know we're going to go back to Hawaii. Um, we know New Minnesota, Orleans, New Orleans, but we do usual, have some, but we new, have some places. new places that we're going to travel to as well. Right. We don't know them yet, but we're going to find out where they are. Yeah, baby. Exactly. <laughs> Let's go, babe. Well, thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys in the next one.